Okay, so in this video, we are looking at arithmetic series. So what is an arithmetic series? An arithmetic series is the sum of the terms in an arithmetic sequence. So we use SN to denote the sum of the first N terms of a sequence. So S1 is the sum of the first term. Uh, S3 is the sum of the first three terms. That'd be T1 plus T2 plus T3. So like one plus so say for example, I have the sequence one, three, five, seven, nine, and I want to find S4. That's going to be one plus three plus five plus seven is the sum of the first four terms. So S4 is equal to four, nine, uh, 16. So the sum of the first four terms is 16. So similarly to the general term with the arithmetic sequence we have a formula to find the general term of an arithmetic series so this formula is in your log table so sn equals n over 2 times 2a plus n minus 1 d so where uh, a is my first term and d is my first difference so we can use sn to quickly calculate the sum of any number of terms without having to calculate all the terms individually. So given the arithmetic sequence 2 plus 10 plus 18, find the sum of the first 10 terms. So a is equal to 2 because that's my first term. d is going to be equal to 8, so that's my first difference. So find the sum of the first 10 terms. So I'm looking for s10. So s10 is going to be equal to... So if you recall up here, my formula is SM. SN equals 10 over 2 times 2A. So 2, so sorry, SN is equal to N over 2 times 2A plus N minus 1D. So I know N is equal to 10. So 10 over 2 times 2 times 2 plus 10 minus 1 times 8. S10 is equal to 5 times 4. Plus 10 minus 1 is 9. 9 times 8 is 72. S10 is going to be equal to 72 times... 72 plus 4 times 5 is going to be equal to 380. So S10 is equal to 380. So, next one here, find S20. Well, S20 is going to be equal to uh, 20 divided by 2 times 2 times 2 plus 20 minus 1 times 8. Put all that into your calculator. I'm going to get 10 times 4 plus 19 times 8 is 152. 1560 S20. Then finally, it's asking me find the sum of the second uh, 10 terms. So I know the first 10 terms is 380, and I know the first 20 terms is 1560. I want to find terms, I want to find the sum from, I want to find the sum of terms 11. To 20, so T11 plus T12 da, 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 up to T20. I want to find this. So how I can find this is well, that's just going to be S20 subtract S10 because S20 is my first 20 terms added together. S10 is my first 10 terms added together. So therefore, if I take them away, I'm looking at the sum of my second half. So that is going to be 1560 minus 380 which is equal to 1180. So that is the sum of the second 10 terms. Right, so let's have a look at some exam questions. So this one here is from 2021. Uh, the first three terms of an arithmetic sequence are four, nine, and 14. Find S50, the sum of the first 50 terms in the sequence. So remember Sn equals n divided by two times two a plus n minus 1d. So S50 is going to be 50 divided by 2 times 2a. A is my first term. So therefore, my first term is 4. Plus 50 minus 1. And then d is my first difference, which is 
25. So S50 is equal to 25 times 8. 49 times 5. So 253 times 25. That's going to be S50 is equal to 6,325. There's the sum of my first 50 terms there. Right, so we're looking at the 2014 um, question here. So the general term of arithmetic sequence is 15 minus 2n, uh, where n is a natural number. Write down the first three terms of the sequence. So I'm looking for t1, t2, and t3. So t1 is going to be equal to 15 minus 2 times 1, which is 13. Uh, 15 minus 2 times 2, which is 11. And then 15 minus 2 times 3, which is 9. So there are my first three terms there. Find the first negative term of the sequence. So I know t3 is equal to 9. So therefore t4, 7, uh, 5, 3, 1, minus 1. Okay, here's my first negative term. That's t5, t6, t7, t8. So the 8th term is going to be my first negative term. Fine. This one here, find Sn, the sum of the first uh, n terms of the series. So we're looking for my general term here. So I need Sn equals n over 2 times 2a plus n minus 1d. So um, I know a is my first term. That's going to be 13. And D is my first difference, which is minus 2, because I'm going down in 2s here. So sub it in, I get Sn equals N over 2 times uh, 2 times 13 plus N minus 1 times minus 2. N over 2 equals 26 minus 2N plus 2, that's going to be n over 2 times 28 minus 2n. So that is going to be 28n minus 2n squared all over 2. So remember when I have a fraction of a 2, um, I notice here I'm dividing every term by 2. So 28n divided by 2 is 14n. And then minus 2n squared is just going to be minus n squared. So there is my Sn there. And then finally, the last part here, find the value of n for which the sum of the first n terms of the series is 0. So I want to find Sn is equal to 0. So 14n minus n squared equals 0. Uh, let me factorise my left hand side here. So I'm going to factor in n. I'm left with 14 minus n equals 0. n is equal to 0. 14 minus n is equal to 0, n is equal to 14. So I can't have a 0 term in a sequence, so therefore n has to equal 14. There are some questions, exam questions there on arithmetic series. So just remember to use your formula and label your values and sub them in and you'll be a-okay. And uh, hopefully this video has some help to you guys and I'll catch you guys later. Bye. <laughs>